how to use the wah wah effect in Audacity. So this is kind of a fun one. It's a kind of a weird little filter you can put over your track. Um, I can't think of an actual use I've had for it yet, but nevertheless, here's how to use it. So go ahead and have a track ready. I'm just going to record one here for an example real quick. Testing, 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 testing. Okay, so I have my track here. Go ahead and select all of it. Okay, um, here we'll just play it back so you know testing, testing, what it sounds testing, like normally. Testing. Okay, and then go up and select effect and then go down to where it says wah wah. Okay, and then we'll have our effect here. Go ahead and select on apply. And then you can go ahead and select on the X. And then if we go ahead and hit play, testing, 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 testing. So it's kind of like your voice is cutting in and out and in and out. Like it's going from the foreground all the way to the background. Kind of something like that. So that's how you use the wah-wah effect in Audacity. You can, of course, if we go back to effect, hit repeat wah-wah. And then it will actually emphasize it on more if we can actually hit it a couple times. So now if we go ahead and play it. Pressing, pressing, testing, testing. So it sounds a little bit more unique there. Um, another thing you can do just to make it a little bit more fun is select on the uh, normalize option. And we select on that and then play it. Pressing, pressing, testing, testing. So that's a little bit more of a better example of how to use the wah-wah effect. So that is, though, how you use the wah-wah effect in Audacity.